Starting next year, students at Plainwell High School who are in extracurricular activities will be subject to required random drug testing. Well, there's a lot of controversy surrounding this new policy that was approved tonight. 13 on your side's Amar Boss was at the school board meeting and is here now with that decision. Amar? Yeah, Juliet, the new drug testing policy will also include nicotine. School leaders hope it will deter teens from vaping. But some parents say the new policy is unfair and will alienate some kids from participating. Yeah, my son's a wrestler. Michael Hewshin's son wrestles at Plainwell High School. He could be uh, tested, yes. Monday night in a 5-2 to two vote, school leaders in Plainwell approved a new random drug testing policy for any student who is involved in extracurricular activities. I think that if we can save one kid's life, one kid's life, to me, this is worth it. The new policy will test substances like cocaine and marijuana, but school leaders say they also added nicotine because of the vaping epidemic. Vaping in particular has been a real serious issue, and we have had several students that have had to go home with flu-like symptoms. They've had to go to the hospital. All athletes could be tested, as well as students in the high school musical and National Honor Society. If the student fails a drug test, they could be suspended from play for a period of time or dismissed from their group or club. I think it's wrong. You know, kids are going to experiment. But it is legal, according to the Supreme Court, who ruled in 2002 that extracurricular activities are a privilege, saying because this policy reasonably serves the school district's important interest in detecting and preventing drug use among its students, we hold that it is constitutional. My biggest concern is if you fail this, um, you could just walk away from the activity. Now, Plainwell High School has a little more than 800 students and around 30 students will be drug tested each cycle. The testing is scheduled to begin next month. Nick?